Knights hosting the Oilers, and the Oilers are minus 144 on the money line. The Knights are plus 118. The over-under is at 6.5 goals. The Oilers, laying a goal and a half on the puck line, are plus 168, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game, it has to be by two goals or more. The game has to end in regulation. The Knights, getting a goal and a half on the puck line, are minus 205, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you would win, or if they lose this game by one goal, you would win. Now, these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to puck drop tomorrow. Now, the Oilers are looking to make it 17 games in a row that they've won. So the, they're on fire is uh, an understatement. The All-Star break might have hurt them more than it helped them. They played each other once this year, and the Oilers won that game 5-4 to four in a shootout. As far as the goaltenders are concerned for tomorrow's game, it's supposed to be Skinner, who has been confirmed, and Hill, who has not been confirmed yet. Head to head, they're five and five against each other. The road team is six and four. The underdog is six and four. The underdog on the money line. The underdog getting a goal and a half on the puck line is seven and three. There have been four one goal games in their last ten. The over is hit in their last three. The over is six three and one, and the over six and a half goals is seven and three. As I said, the of the Oilers are on a sixteen game winning streak. There was a total of four goals, five goals, three goals, and five goals. Three goals and a win. Four goals and a win, three goals and a win, and then four goals and a win. And they figured out how to play defense and goaltending. The under has hit in their last 10 games that they've played. For the Knights, they are 2-2 two and two in their last four. 11 goals, 5 goals, 7 goals, 7 goals. 5 goals and an overtime loss, 3 goals and a win, 5 goals and a win, 2 goals and a loss. The last four that they played, they were on the road. I'm going to take the Oilers with the money line. I will take the Knights getting the goals, and I'm going to go under. I do think that the Knights can keep it close, but we'll see if the winning streak just extends. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.